Okay, here we are. This is lesson seven of drawing the Ferrari F12. And what we're working on, as you see, is the uh, driver's side of the car. And I did some work off camera. I'm doing the uh, lower rocker panel right now. And I did a little bit on the interior. I tried to ghost in the uh, seats and the rear parcel shelf in here. And uh, they still need, will need work when they get to that point. But uh, what I'm trying to do is get, get some of the ink laid down on this so that we have something to start with to, uh, to get to the end here. And uh, most of the body has been done now. And there you see just working on the, on the lower rail, lower uh, body part there. Okay, still going along. And um, I need to do the mirror, as you see here, and some of the side and a little bit on the, on the front hood yet. And then the largest section will be the, the midsection of the car and the door all the way back to the rear. And I think we can get the rear done today or most of it done today. We'll see how that works out. Again, we're, this is not final. These are these are things that I'm putting in now, just because I know I'm going to have to come back again anyway, and we're going to adjust the the color values, the tonal values, at the end of this. So I'm not too concerned about the way they are, but but they are at least a start, so that it can serve kind of as a placeholder for where I'm going to go, and then check one one level of uh, color against the others. And that's where all of this comes in, where it all gets uh, gets interesting. The photograph that I have, uh, the window kind of obscures all the interior of the car. So I'm trying to do something similar to that with what I'm drawing here. But it's coming out fine so far. Pretty happy with it. Okay, and there we go. I'm darkening up a little bit on the on the A post. And a little bit more on the hood too. And what you see here, like I say, I'm I'm trying to make the interior of the car of a value that I can, that it looks similar to what the photograph does. Now I started working on the mirror here too. This is going to help sell it a little bit better because the mirror, by being darker, will come forward to you and it'll look, give kind of a 3D effect. Uh, I don't have a shadow underneath it yet, which I will have when I darken up the side. But uh, what I'm trying to do is to show that there is a difference between the mirror and the interior of the car. So there we go. You can see this is kind of an intermediate value too around the uh, both windows on the driver's side. It's lighter than the than the posts are themselves on the other side. So uh, this is just to show again an intermediate value. The rear of the car has uh, about half and half, very dark and, and the intermediate. And I already did the light value, which is up on top, because that's actually hit by light. It's a highlight on there, and uh, these other parts will be somewhat darker. So that's what I'm doing right now. And this, the differences here are going to show the... Uh, the contour of the body and as it gets hit by light what it's going to do to it and how it changes it so you can tell that there is some roundness to the body okay like I said we're not going to finish with the rear of the body today we're kind of getting close on time now but uh, uh, with any luck we may get the side done tomorrow at least part of the side done tomorrow 
And then uh, after that, we'll start to work on the wheels and tires. And then our final thing will be the once over on the car. And all of it's coming along pretty well so far. I'm, I'm really happy with it. But uh, we'll see what we can do in the end. Anyway, that's it for today. I hope to see you back tomorrow. Thank you very much. Bye.